Cappuccino Bambino finally comes. Anyway, Sylvie's must be close to being done now. Look at that. Look at that pudgy boy. Gabby finally arrives at the end of the lesson. Lucky for us, our coach likes us. Brenda, you like us, right? You don't mind when the kid shows up at the end of the lesson? <laughs> he prefers at the beginning, but you know. <laughs> we'll take it as, as it comes. Brandon's pretty laid back. Brandon just called Gabby a lady child. I've heard, I've heard child man. He, yeah, that's true. When, when were you supposed to be born? April 18th. April 18th? Holy, 2007? Yeah, April 18th, Gabby was supposed to be born and she was uh, evicted a week late. And you didn't even come then. I had to kick you out. Let me go get my walker. Let Brandon go get his walker. Don't let him get away. scared of me. All right, so one of Chino's least favorite things to do is poles. He is not a pole lover. So, Gabby's like, he's so slow. He feels so slow. See, this is how Chino likes to ride. <laughs> you just take me time. So we never, so we don't ride horses in a frame until they're warmed up. So that's what Gabby's doing now. That's why she's letting him have such a long rein. Brandon, is it a horse? On Thursday? He can't say yes, but he can't say no. He's not giving me any more details or any more clues. Oh my gosh, is it a horse? We could show up on Thursday, next Thursday. Next Thursday or this Thursday? Next Thursday? Next Thursday. And what is supposed to be here today? Like, where should they go? Should be costs, you know? didn't land soon enough. Shipping costs, airplane didn't land soon enough. What the heck? What the heck is happening? Did you hear that? Oh my God, I think our coach bought a horse for Sophie. He said she has to have an open mind. And that's the kind of guy he is. I feel like this is the first time Gabby and Chino's energies have matched. <laughs> yeah. Oh, no spurs. Maybe Chino's. So Brandon's been saying he's going to take away those spurs. I hate the spurs. I absolutely hate them. This is Chino without spurs. Yeah, you think so? He's looked like this before. Brandon says he thinks this is the best Chino's ever actually looked, but 
I like Chino with a little bit of weight on him for sure. I definitely think he does like having weight on him too. Do you think? He also likes being a, a, in the boss of the herd. You're so dusty. Hey, I brushed him good. <laughs> yeah, and I even brushed this one too. I helped her. It's coming. The clippers are coming. I like the no stirs, Brandon. Spurs. I don't. Did you tell her not to wear them? No. She just knows. Is it because you know, or is it because it was? She just didn't have time, probably. Half all there. Don't crush into your big forward truck, right? We want the half all to use his butt a little bit more. Ease him back into this program. Keep him tall and steady. Look at the muscles on him. Same thing. Press him to the center of the pole. Yeah. So he, to around, 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 right? he comes around. There's another horse in the arena. He's like, whoa, look at me go. Too chubby. <laughs> See, you know, Chino's definitely happier. Happier without those spurs. There's a whole lot of pooping going on in this arena. Don't you know that you're beautiful? 